Oh, I'm happy to see you too. Let's get that restraining bolt off of you. Droids. Let's get out of here before the same happens to us. That's how you do it. Speedy, we gotta get through this way. Job done. But I think the power still needs to be on. <laughs> BD, think you can charge this? Hear that? Sounds like someone is home after all. Hey, I recognize this band. We had action on how long it would take me to get here. And who are you? <laughs> who am I? I'm Sword Tormo, baby. I'm the boss of this operation. You have Breezy Forearms to thank for bringing us together. I will, as soon as we get out of here. We have a special challenger for you tonight. An enforcer from a bygone era. A Jedi! Let's see what he's got! Oh, somebody get baby his toy. <laughs> show? I'll give you a show. I smell blood and a money! Tonight, we celebrate the small calendars of the past. And the great sacrifice they made to make us all Maybe you should 
come down and face me yourself. <laughs> I'm too busy counting my credits. <laughs> Great, you talked to us. Breeze. You're famous down there. Yeah, they're an ugly group, huh? They smell like used droid oil. <laughs> At least they're okay. Yeah, a complication we could have avoided. Luckily, we found him. We have another complication. The Empire knows about the Holocron. That's not good. The entire mission is now at risk. And I had a nice chat with the second sister, Trilla. What did she tell you? She told me... She told me you betrayed her to the Empire. Is it true? She'll say anything to jeopardize this mission. Is it true? She was my apprentice. Before the purge. You should have told me. We're getting an encrypted message from Kashyyyk. Mari. Cal, we found Tarful, and he is willing to meet you. That's not all. The Empire overran our position at the refinery. Saw retreated off-world. Some of us have joined the Wookiee fighters in the forests. Be careful. You too. Later. Later. We have our lead. Fine. 
Everything is gonna be fine. I don't know what's going on between you and her. I mean, I figure it's some kind of Jedi thing, but I don't think this is the right time for it's it. It's not any of your business. I think it's my business. And we're all in this together, aren't we? Hey, Cal. I made a mistake. And I almost got you killed. Sorry. I mean, we all make mistakes, right? <laughs> or maybe not you. <laughs> hey, why don't you cut her some slack? I'm not saying do it for me, but you two are the best thing that ever happened in my life. <laughs> Before you came along, all I cared about was a tight hand on a stiff eater. <laughs> That's a game term. I know what it is. Now life's not a game. Before you two, all I cared about was myself. Easy money. Now it's different. this thing. What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of embarrassed glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. Ready to go? En route to Kashyyyk. 
know, even after all the action you two bring, I still get a thrill watching the games. Yeah, as long as you keep your habits in check. Oh, yeah. No, of course. I'm, I'm just a spectator. <laughs> no gambling or nothing going on. Really? Yeah, we're talking pure entertainment. Nothing gets me going more than watching a couple slubs square off. Just slick moves and brute force. Captain, I am slightly troubled by your enthusiasm for something so... barbaric. Oh, yeah, I mean, I, it is true. Totally barbaric, but still... kind of entertaining. All right, we're here. Get in your chair. If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. Let's talk later, Cal.